Hey folks, you're back with Big Cheesy for another episode of Subnautica. This time, we are starting out in the beautiful, beautiful day above water with flying things. I've never actually scanned them before. I've never scanned them before. You can scan them, but they just fly away before I ever get even near them. Last episode, guys, we went diving into the deep dark, really deep dark area um, of the game. We got down about 900 feet, I think, 900 meters, sorry. Um, thank you, Sandy. I love you for that. Um, I've seen some suggestions for names for the prawn suit. Um, I'm gonna give a little bit more time on them because I know that there's some people, some friends of mine and stuff like that um, that are waiting to watch the episode and still recommend names. But there is a name that um, has already got a couple of likes on it and I really like it. It's just nice and happy. Um, but I, like I said, we will name the prawn suit properly in the next episode. This episode, however, what I need to do, because, okay, last episode, we, we dealt with the fear pretty well. You know. No, we didn't deal with fear. I didn't deal with fear at all, okay? Crab, squid, warpers, they stuck. They really stuck. As much as I love Sandy, I need something with a bit more kick, a bit more oomph. Um, even though I can put torpedoes on Sandy, I may look at doing that. Maybe. Um, what I need to do, okay, what I'm going to do is I'm headed out towards the life pod today, okay? So there's one over there and the one over there. Um, the 250 meter one, I feel that like might be my better bet for finding the final bloody fragment of the Cyclops engine. Now, if I can get that, then I can get my Cyclops. And I need names for that eventually. Um, <laughs> but first, name for that. Like I said, next episode. Um, if I can get that, that means that we have safety because as far as I know, I cannot be teleported out of my Cyclops. There are things that still can happen to the Cyclops. I could still be attacked by Reapers, apparently, and destroyed and whatever. Um, but Warp is no longer a thing, so I cannot get killed in one go. And being on Hardcore, I am terrified of that happening. Terrified. <laughs> so, I'm standing up here because I have a radio message, for one. I'm really hoping it's going to be the one I really want. This is Life Pod 4. No, it's not We've one. landed close to the Aurora. Flotation device is active, but we've got some big old fish in the water with us, and I don't know how long we're going to last. We're close to the crash site, so bring radiation already. protection. Four out. Signal coordinates corrupted. Approximate Welcome transmission aboard, origin Captain. recorded to date to bank. Fantastic. Right, okay, we're off towards this life pod first. Now, I remember, yes, we found two pieces of the Cyclops engine out towards this way. There may be one I missed. Okay, I may have gone to mess with the Reapers for no goddamn reason, and it would not surprise me even a little bit if that was the case. Um, yeah, I mean, you're just stalkers. Why am I getting scared? <laughs> it does still tingle up my spine when I hear those noises, and that's not even like the worst noises. That's fine. Okay, you need to shut up now. I said you were scary. You had your moment. Bugger off. Ooh. What was that? That's just sand shark, right? It's just a sand shark. It's just a sand shark, it's fine. Um, it didn't grab me, it's fine. Last episode we messed with a few creatures that I feel like could have done a hell of a lot more damage to Sandy than I would have liked. I need to grab these actually while I'm here. Um, I'm very low on gold and silver and all sorts of stuff like that. So when I see these sandstone ones, I need to grab them and make sure I do. Um, I see that people are enjoying the video though. I mean, glad, you know, jump on Sonoka, it's fantastic. It's as scary as I am finding it, okay? It is so much better playing it yourself, especially if you turn the lights off and you have reaper noises in the background. It is just the best experience ever. <laughs> um, I've seen some of those. They have messaged me and said that they're playing it on an Oculus. I think Nikki. I think Nikki's the one who said that. Um, and I would love to play this in VR or... I, I've been looking at getting like an Oculus or a Quest or something. Um, there's a few games that I would really like to play and I think the this one would be amazing. Um, on the Oculus, and I've been mean, looking at a few others like um, the Saints and Sinners for the uh, Walking Dead series. Um, I lo that looked fantastic, um, but you know, I could do BZ maybe on the Oculus or Quest or something if I find one. If I ever get around to buying one, um, that's not top of my priority list. Like, right, making these videos, top of my, <laughs> top of my priority list. Um, I don't like this. God, they say pretty. I don't like it. It's pretty, but I don't like it. I don't like you. I really don't like you. I don't know how much damage you do. I know how much damage you do, you're a bitch. Sunk to the ocean bed. Okay, we're still going. I haven't really seen any pieces. Has anyone seen anything? If you see it and I don't see it, please let me know in the comments. I 
Sorry. <laughs> Alright. That's just that's just a volcano. I don't need to be scared of that. It's just a volcano. But you guys are everywhere. How am I gonna get out? I don't even think there is a PDA in there, at the very least. Is there anything? I, I do want the egg as well. I'm planning on making um, a big tower um, in my base at some point, and hopefully by the end of this episode, uh, I will have put some time into making that. And it's going to be like we have on these areas here, but this one, there's a whole lot of eggs, and you can turn... Where are you guys gone? Are you gone? Activity and Ooh, this the best time. Electro this is the best time. I, I get out in the burning, Exercise but... Yep, yep, just shut up and play the thing. I'm uh, not really a doctor. I know that's what my <laughs> ID says, but I never have been. That's the first way to open up. Cheated mm. the medical exams. What does a doctor uh, these uh, days uh, need to know about Sandy. manually resetting Sandy. things? <laughs> when was the last time a top surgeon actually cut someone open? That's what the robots are for. Doctors these days right. read diagnoses Damn. off of computer readouts. For that, sure. I'm not well, qualified. Well, Sandy. But what good is it when I'm not connected to the main you network? Don't, you, 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 you. I'm bleeding. I can see I've got Sam glowing Sanchez, green again. pustules growing on my hands. How can I you affect this so quickly? And it tells me I've got skin irritation. No, the kidding. only thing I studied in medical school was how to lie convincingly. What the hell do I know about how to treat an alien disease? I'm actually going to die down here. Yep. Though by look of it, not from the disease. I don't think Sandy's going to be able to fit. Okay, just about squeezed it through. You got a big ass on you, Sandy, but not that big, clearly. I don't think I'm meant to be taking Sandy all the way down here, to be fair with you. You're out of my crystal. Ooh, this could be handy. So I'm really tensed up, and I don't know what I need to stop. <laughs> Um, there's nothing scary ish, it's just it's just the walls. <laughs> I need nickel though, I do need That's not nickel, is it? I didn't like that noise just then. I can hear like weird gurgling noises in the background, which may mean crab squids. I do need rubies. Uh give me give me light, there we go, that'd be alright. Okay, scan, yeah, give me the thing. Sorry, yeah, so he's, um, he's dead. <laughs> but yeah, he got infected much quicker than we did. Um, I haven't actually done a cell scan, I think, since we got told to do one. Back at the, um... Let's try this. Self-scan complete. Bacterial infection has spread to the skin and pulmonary system. Okay. Medical okay. report recorded to date to bank. It is Data imperative bank. you find a way to neutralize the infection. Thanks, thanks for the tip there. Yeah, neutralize the effect. Great, thanks for that. Whoa, what's going on? Ooh, ooh. Was this in it last time? I didn't feel like that was in it last time. I want the creature egg. That's cool. That's very cool. There's like weird music. Although I got much, I thought something else was going to happen there. I was kind of getting very. No, I wasn't getting scared. I'm not saying that. I'm just saying, you know. Hypothetically, if you got scared there, it, it wouldn't be embarrassing, right? Okie dokie the folks, I found my way out and I found wreckage. I'm really hoping Cyclops engines around here, although I'm not really because the bloody... What's that? Is that something I'm... Sorry fishies. Is there anyone bad nearby? I hate that. Just so much darkness. I can't see shit. Ah, uh, fuck it. Uh, no, I've got that. What am I doing? Okay. What else is around here? Does that mean nothing around here, is there? Other than death. Death, destruction. Oh, no. It's not a bad one. Have I been here? Nope. Yes. Maybe. Uh, I will cut it open. I just want to do this first. Come on. What's in there? Something to scan. Are you kidding me? That's all I get. Chic plant pots. Wonder freaking full. What else have I got in here? Come on, give me something good. Give me something good. 
Push. Oh, great. Another entry. Fantastic. That's exactly what I wanted. God damn! Hey, give me something helpful. I need that. I need that. And I need that. <laughs> Sorry, this is probably the stupidest way of doing it. I don't get uh and I need water. Great, for the love of God. There Vital we go. signs. Right, get the bloody there we go. Cut the door open. How are you guys doing? <laughs> How are you doing? Hope you have a nice time out there. It's nice. I, I, you know, I, if you've watched any of this, I love the rain, and it's been so lovely to be working in it a little bit the last couple of days. Um, yeah, it's just been really nice. And just the sound. I've missed the sound. I've missed the smell. I've missed the rain. Oh man. How are you guys doing? Have you been up to anything fun? Up to anything? Ooh, do I need that? I might need that. No, I don't need that. I could have built that ages ago. God damn it. Is that all that was in here? And for the love of God. Fine. Fine. Um, there is nothing out there. There is nothing out there. There is nothing out there. Just go for the thing. You're fine. Just go for it. You're fine. Don't worry about it. Welcome aboard, Captain. I went for a bit too hard there, I think. Yeah, if, um, how many of you guys are thinking of getting this game now that you're watching? I mean, you might not be. I know, like, there's at least one friend of mine who, who likes to look at this game, but he's just going to watch me do it instead. But that's what I'm here for, right? But... I love this game. I know there's some people I've been um, chatting to in like some Nautica groups and stuff like that, and they've got like 130 hours in the game. And that's some of the smaller numbers, to be fair. And it's like, uh, ooh. Okay, that wasn't too bad. I was just kind of terrified. Um, okay. Do you know what? You guys never scared me that much before. Hardcore is maybe a pansy. <laughs> oh shit! Why are there so many of you? Why are you so aggressive? Leave me alone, please. Please leave me alone. I need to repair. I need to repair Sandy. I need time to repair Sandy. Ooh, I don't like that noise. I don't like that noise. I don't like that noise. Go. Just go. Just go. Don't look back. Don't. I wasn't intending for this one to be quite as scary an episode as it's turning out to be. Leave me alone! Just leave me alone. Just leave me alone. How about that? How about we don't? How about we don't? I need to stop and repair and goddamn. What's that? Could that be it? Could that be it? Can that just be the engine? Can we say that's the... Oh, I don't know. This is a bad idea, isn't it? This is a stupid idea to get out and try and... Fuck in. Bugger off. Just go away. Go away. Go away. Go away. I need to scan it. Oh, I just sod you. I'm not doing it. If it's there, if, it, if that's it, I'm going to be so pissed. But I, I don't feel like... That's the whole fragment. C could that be it? I need to repair Sandy. I need to do so much crap. <laughs> right, where's the repair? Give me, where's Sandy? Where the hell is Sandy? I'm inside Sandy already. Patch, repair, repair, go, 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 go. Dang, dang. Right, now, where is he? Okay, what we're going to do is tactical driving. Now, come here. Yep, I see you. Die! Nope, okay. I'm sure I hit him. You are, are you, okay, you are swimming away. Though not in the right direction. And now you stop, right, come here. Come here, no, don't swim, don't. There, no, go away. Go away. Go away. Go away! Are you going to go away? Please go away. Are you dead? One of the two. Either one's fine. I don't see you. Okay, I'm going to regret this. This is not going to be it, is it? It's Moonpool. 
Oh, for feck's sake! I think we saw that for the moon pool, and now Sandy is back down to 65. Oh, that's goddamn ridiculous. I need the Cyclops though. Like, so, okay, this is not just for my safety either. So when we went down to um, the last facility, when we found out all about hull, hull fragment, I think. But we found out all about, so I keep getting distracted by little fragments and it's not, get them away. When did you bite? You suck. That's the bulk. I do need that actually, to be fair. Okay, one second. Keep it with Sandy. I keep missing Sandy. <laughs> um, when we went down to the facility last episode, I was going to say yesterday. Um, I don't need this. I didn't need that. I thought that was something very different. You can sod off. Fine. There. I'd check that. Yeah? Sod you. Like that. You should trade insurance details. I have none. Dick. Um, yes, sorry. <laughs> I get very angry at these creatures. <laughs> um, when we were down in the facility on the last episode, um, there was another area that I could swim out to. However, I was already at about 850 depth, and Sandy, as we can see, can only go down to 900. Cyclops can go much, much deeper than that. Um, she's also safer. She won't get destroyed quite so easily. And I do think Sandy can get destroyed even when I'm not in her. I think they target her because they're bullies, frankly. Everyone in this game, every fish, whatever swimming along, even the little peepers, they are bullies, okay? They bully Sandy when I'm not around, and I can't be having that. All right, Sandy's not made for bullying. She's meant to be look after, and I don't do a very good job of that at the moment anyway. What? Oh, is this another tunnel or the same tunnel? I feel like this is, a, oh, okay, this is a crap tunnel. I need the bloody thing. You need to go away. You are very fast, though. Your turning circle not so great, but yeah, you're very fast. Oh, what is that scream? I haven't done any of the, um, when I did this before, I set up loads of beacons so I know exactly where I am at all the time. I haven't done any of that yet, which I really should get into, like, because this is like the lily pad forest, I think. Um, and it's handy knowing where that stuff is, because I, I do... Oh, oh sugar! Oh, sugar! Oh, shit! Let go! 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 No! 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 What the hell is that? What the hell? Okay. My game has crashed, I, I think. I'm, I'm gonna close it, because I think I might be able to just avoid Screwing up the hardcore thing. If I can't, I'd be so pissed. Ready? And then one come off oh, for feck's sake.
So pissed. That was like 10 hours. Oh, I'm so angry. I'm so angry. <laughs> For God's sake. Oh. All right, do you know what? Right, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna show you around my other base, okay, for the rest of this episode, because I'm so angry now. I was like 10, 11 hours worth of work there. For me, it went, like when it went black there for ages, that wasn't, I don't know what it was doing. Because it stopped showing me being eaten, and I was, maybe I was inside his stomach at that point, but I was kind of in. Oh. Well, okay. Hardcore mode sucks. And like at least you guys can see that I'm on hardcore. I don't actually get oxygen alerts anymore. That was a thing. Yeah. Um <sighs> oh. <laughs> Why? Why? Ah, uh, Subnautica gods, you suck ass. But he, this, he took everything. I was on 70 plus, this is where I look back at the footage and I was really on like 40. But I saw it go down to 40 when he was bashing me about. Unless he grabbed me twice while I was on the... And then like, even when he destroyed it, I should have got out. I should have got out earlier and swam for it. Oh, I didn't want to leave Sandy. Sandy, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry, Sandy. Okay, ladies and gentlemen. I'm not going to show you everything because that will spoil some things. But this was my original Seamoth. Okay, she... This is Explorer. I was so cool, wasn't I? God damn. Uh, this is from a base about yeah a year or so ago, a year and a half ago. Um, she's armed to the teeth, she has torpedo bays, um, she has a lot of torpedoes, I believe. She's got plenty of storage, she's kick ass. She's my little war machine. And Sandy, um, Sandy 2 will be the same, okay? Now, base was not as like, impressive as I thought it was, but as you can see over here, this is the Cyclops. What did I call her? Bertha. Oh, Bertha started way back here. Oh my god, she's not going to be called Bertha in the next one. Maybe she will be called Bertha, I don't know. But yeah, black and yellow, I think, is what I went with this one. I don't know how it's in a phase. This is what we will be building at some point, okay? Um, next episode, because I'm going to have to redo everything. Next episode, we will be on um, the Cyclops by the time I join you guys back into it. But Cyclops is amazing, like you can put everything in it. She has tons and tons of storage space. Um, look, these are the, right, these are the lockers you get and you can build inside her as well. And she's badass. Just badass. I'm not like to be fair, the organizational thing started way back here. <laughs> um, I think they're all pretty much full as well of everything. Um, but she's very cool. Like, I mean, you can change everything here. You have, I, I put in the fabricator, battery charger, and it all feeds off the Cyclops. Um, you can put food in here, which I did. Um, she has tons of power cells. And what did I, I didn't put much in her, to be fair with you. 1500 health. I never lost her, okay? So there were times when she did catch fire, which was close to death. Have I got anything in there? No, no, it's not. You can, you can dock, uh, Sandy or a prawn suit in the Cyclops and go down with it. How deep can you go? How low can you go? I said, how low can you go? Sorry, I don't know what I'm doing. How low can you go? Oh, okay. I ain't got much on the Cyclops. I think I did most of the stuff with Sandy then. Or the prawn suit. I might have done it with the prawn suit. I think, yeah, when I played this the first time, I got to the Cyclops very later on. I didn't even realize it was a thing. Um, I kind of found a few bits for it and then I didn't hunt for it that much because when I was doing this, this one is on just survival and if you die in survival you drop your stuff but you don't lose everything. Oh, I did a little farm and everything. Oh, wasn't I organized back then? So young, full of hope. Welcome aboard, All the world Captain. made me so bitter. <laughs> 
Oh yeah, poster. God damn, this is nice little memory. Oh yes, this is what's on that bulkheads. You can seal these up behind you. Um, what is over here? Oh, a little aquarium. Oh yeah, God wasn't eyes, so whatever. Um, is actually anything out here? Oh, it's my bedroom. Oh yeah, I put. This would mean I get very into grabbing all of these things and putting them out. Um, habitat power restored. Oh, I've got a second base in this one, don't I? Yeah, okay, that might be why there's not so much stuff that I thought there was here. Seal that up. Yeah, so this is what you do. Um, bulkheads keep, if, it, if anything springs a leak, it seals off your compartments better. Um, can I, I'm not seeing, Jimmy, why did I call it Jimmy? I'm not gonna show you guys this because this is something later on. But yeah, see, like, I mean, I, I kind of, I set out everything in this. Gate. What was gate? Oh, uh, the walk gates. Lava, tree, blood kelp, all the life pods. I'm not going to show you all this stuff because we'll, I don't remember the story entirely. Um, and I'd rather try and experience some of it with you guys as well, anyway. God, this base is ages ago. I don't I don't know why I built it like that. <laughs> Moon pool, modification. Jimmy's over here. Right, we'll fit, meet Jimmy later. I don't know. That's kind of good. But this is what I want to build in my, um, I was going to say in my hardcore playthrough, but I don't have a hardcore playthrough anymore. <laughs> Crab squids and this is where you can put everything in here. I don't know what you couldn't, but that, there's a, so there's somewhat like, there's a few people who play some Nokko who've never seen cuttlefish before. But that little dude right there is cuttlefish. Now, if I can, where is it? There's the door. Well, not the door, ladder. Where's the door? Oh, it's up there. And they don't attack me, as far as I know. Where are you? There you are. I need to take cuttlefish. And I'll put him outside because he plays around outside. He's very cute when he's outside. You can pet him and do sort of all sorts of things. But I got very into building a big aquarium, making it nice for everybody. And whatever. <laughs> and then some Nautica decides to be an asshole and take away everything. Um where I made this crap base, didn't I? This is not well thought out. Came in here. From there? Oh, I don't even know. Just, just get out. Let's just get out. Um, release. I, the thing was that I didn't even see it. Uh, -huh. uh play with, oh, wait a minute. Look, yeah. You give it like a little thing. It's like, ah, oh, cute. Ah. Okay, do you know what? I feel better now just playing with this guy. Um, is there anything else? No, same thing. You can say farewell. I never knew you could do that. This will not make sense. But like I said, I think I said in the first episode, our goal is to kind of get off this uh, planet. And at the end of this, I saved it just before I did. And I didn't realize you could do this. Come here. Where are you? Where are you? Uh, where have you gone? Oh, there you are. Uh, R2. Calorie intake recommended. Aww. Oh, I didn't know that was a thing. Oh, that, that breaks my heart a little bit. <laughs> um, and yeah, here's Jimmy. <laughs> Jimmy the Badass. Uh, red and black we went with. Drill arm and what the hell was that? Grapple arm? Um, and a prawn suit. Welcome aboard, Captain. 900 in depth. Is that all I went to for you as well? Oh, the grapple is a grapple arm. So yeah, with Jimmy, I, that's all I went through with him. Because you can you can use port, uh, proton torpedoes or something like that on him. But the grapple arm's dead handy. You can... What the hell is that on X for? It is on X. How do I jump then? Oh, that's how you jump. Right. Yeah, the drill arm is used for attacking anyway, so I kind of dead handy for everything. Um, I know they haven't dated it now so that when you drill stuff, it just goes straight into your storage rather than when I was drilling it, um, it just, it led on the ground so you have to get out of your safety and grab it before you die. <laughs> but yeah, that's that's my base. Um, I'm curious now, did I... No, that you have 900 as well. Did I really not have something with... Did I take him out Bertha? I can't, I, I don't think I would have survived if I had it 
if I didn't have Bertha. I remember using Bertha a lot. I remember being, being quite a good pilot. <laughs> um, but I remember using Bertha a lot, but maybe I take, I don't know if I took her things out and then used them for something else. I might have done, I may well have done that. I don't know. I don't know, I don't remember now. I honestly don't. But yeah, this was a nice, this is, ah, black and gold. Yeah, you were cool. I wasn't cool. You were. That does it. So, what the hell kind of name is Explorer? What crap was I smoking there? I've got nothing in you. God, I was so cool. Jimmy, I quite liked. But we got better, better name now for that. I think we got better name now. I think I picked it, but I'm not sure. We'll let it on. Uh, we'll, one more episode, and then we'll put this out. But yeah, um, this was my little trip down memory lane after I've now got horrible nightmares from Subnautica, thanks to the goddamn Reaper. Um, I hope you've enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed seeing what I did a year and a half ago or something. Um, I might just, I might delete this one so I have no proof that I ever freaking played this game. I don't know. I'm so hungry. <laughs> the cuddle fish made me feel better for a little while, but now he's gone. And now I'm sad again. Yeah. Anyway, guys. Sorry this one's short and we didn't get a whole lot done. Um, I hope you enjoy the fact that I'm now miserable. Um, maybe for my, you know, sadness, you could chuck some cheddar on that like button for me. Please. <laughs> Uh, if you haven't already guys, if you've enjoyed the episode, if you haven't already, then please subscribe to the channel, um, check some cheddar on that like button for me and share with your friends as well. It does me a great favour, it shares the channel much further than you know, what I do. I don't have very much social media presence at the moment, I'm working on a lot of stuff, um, I'm trying to get better at a lot of stuff, um, but that is slowly but surely, I'm not great at this stuff. But that's, you know, you guys are helping me out immeasurably by sharing it and I'm so grateful to every single one of you who does. Uh, thank you for joining the Cheddar community. Thank you for being here and enjoying my sadness <laughs> um, and enjoying the Reaper. Who was cheering for the Reaper as well? Let you know if you were in the comments, please let me know. And if you haven't already, please yeah, go on to the last video, drop your name and suggestions if you haven't already, um, and upvote you know like the other names. If there's anyone there that you really like, I will probably pick the you know most liked name and we'll go from there. Um, but yeah, say goodbye to Jimmy. Bertha and Explorer. Um, <laughs> Shut up, Ava. I don't need it right now. To be fair, I'd rather, I'd rather starve. It won't cost me anything. I won't lose anything because this is pansy ass game. This isn't hardcore. Um, I don't know why I have all this stuff. I think I was, yeah, that's why I was doing it. You can make a time capsule for people before you go and you can send that out to somebody else's game. And I think I was putting a few iron cubes and bits and pieces so that it gets people started off easier. Or am I? I put the stasis rifle. That's what I did do. I put a stasis rifle in a container for somebody so that they could go to war against the Reapers. It is necessary. You have to. When you get to this stage, you have to go hunting and killing all of them. It's the only way to end it. Or with I've been a bit cheesy, and I hope you've enjoyed this video. <laughs> I will catch you later, guys. It's more Sonoka fun. You will join me on a prepped up, ready to go version of this game. What the hell am I wearing? Okay. Um, I didn't know what the stuff was in it. I forgot what the stuff was in it. I'm just gonna sit here and die, to be fair with you. No, it's fine, it's fine, I'll die. <laughs> um, yeah, join me very soon for some more Sonora Cut, in which, which time we will be ready to face them all. And as the light goes dark, um, so shall I. Goodbye, friends. Bye-bye. <laughs>